WRWD, Z93, Rhythm 94.3, and WGHQ appreciate the opportunity to provide you with this valuable information. Please watch the Kinder Vision video periodically with your children. Instruct and discuss with them the various safety points provided by law enforcement. Also, store this cassette and the completed information card with your valuables for future reference. Protecting our most precious resource and caring for your family is a service Roberts Radio is proud to provide. Your mom sent me to get you. Who are you? Friend of your mom. I've never seen you before. We don't have time for that. Come on, let's go. Come on. Come on. Boys and girls, do you know what to do if this should happen to you? Hi. I lost my little dog on the other side of the park. You think you could help me find him? It's a real cute little black dog, isn't he? You think you could help me find him? Only take a minute. No, I'm sorry, I can't. Are you sure? I could give you five dollars if you help. I've got to go see my parents. Oh, they won't mind. We'll be right back. No. We're just going right over there. Nobody will mind. You won't get in trouble. No. Law enforcement knows that anyone who attempts to abduct a child will abandon a child who knows what to do if confronted. Education is the key to prevention. Hello, I'm Police Detective Chris McDonough, and this is my partner, Paige. Hi, I'm here with some of my play friends. Kinder Vision has asked us to share the following important information to keep you safe from anyone who might harm you. That someone could be a person you've never seen before, a stranger, or someone who lives down the block. Hi, Taylor. Just because you know someone's name or they know yours, that doesn't mean you can trust them. You need to learn how to say no. And mom and dad, practice safe behaviors with your children wherever you are. For example, never leave your child unattended in a car. It only takes a few seconds for a pro to get inside. Kids, when you use a public restroom, don't go alone. Always take someone with you. That's right, mom and dad. Teach your children the importance of playing and walking with other children. Remember, there is safety in numbers and that the buddy system has been proven to work. When young children are in a crowd, they should hold hands with each other or with you, the adult. Remember, kids, when you are in a crowd, always stay together. Hey, little girl. What's your name? Malika. I've got something to show you in my car. If a stranger approaches you or tries to take you away from your friends or get you by yourself, you should yell as loud as you can and run away. No, I don't know you. Come on. Then tell someone you trust right away. Hey kids, what do you yell? Uh... No! Sometimes strangers say things to trick you, like asking for directions, or saying their pet is lost and they need help finding it. Or they may say they need help finding a lost child. Strangers use other tricks, like giving you money, or asking you to play a game, or taking you someplace to show you something different, like a mouse or a snake. Another trick is trying to be your friend, or taking you by the hand to get you into a car or away from safety. This is a dangerous signal. Can I give you a ball of rock? No, I don't know you. No, I don't want to get you a car. You need to get away from that. No! Remember, it's okay to yell no to anyone you do not know. Hey kids, what do you yell? No! no! If anyone grabs you or tries to touch you, cause as much noise or commotion as possible to attract attention. Hey kids, what could you do to attract attention? Kick! Bite! Hit! Yell! Ah! In case of an emergency. Mom and Dad, teach your children how to dial 911 and call home collect. Practice with them what to say when 911 answers and what to say to the telephone operator. Make sure they know their own home telephone numbers. Very good. Another way to protect your child is to create a secret code or password so that they know the adult they are talking to can be trusted. 
practice saying it with your child often. Hey, Mom, might I go outside and play? Yes, you may, but stay in sight. And what's the password? Sandbox. Thanks, Mom. Hey, your mom sent me to get you. Who are you? Friend of your mom's. What's the secret password? Boys and girls, do you know what to do if someone in a car tries to talk to you or get you into the car? You should yell, no, and run away in the opposite direction. Come on. No. And go directly to a house, school, or safety place and tell an adult you trust. Then you should immediately call 911. Hey, kids. What are you? No! And mom and dad, remember to change that password often. Yeah. Also know your child's playmates. Know where they live and keep their names and telephone numbers handy. <laughs> know your babysitters and their family members. Talk to your children about activities that took place while you were away. Establish safe places. Safe places are the homes of friends in the neighborhood or on their way to school where your children can go if there is a problem. Kids, if you are not near home and you become lost or separated from your parents or friends, get help from a police officer or an adult in charge, like the person at the cash register in a store. Remember to pay attention to your feelings. If you don't feel safe, you probably aren't. Mom and Dad, children need to be safe inside the home as well as outside. People are using the internet to establish relationships with children and lure them to danger through chat rooms and email. Protect your children by establishing rules for going online, using commercial software products to screen inappropriate materials, and monitoring your child's internet activity closely. Kids, remember to do the following things to stay safe when using the internet. Don't scan personal photos or give anyone your address or phone number. Don't make plans to meet someone that you've talked to online without your parents' permission. Don't be afraid to tell your parents, whether it's at school, on the playground, in your neighborhood, or on your computer screen. Wyatt! If your child is missing, don't Wyatt! panic. If you're in a store or a mall, immediately Wyatt! contact the manager in security. If you're at home, search your entire Wyatt! house. Look through the closets, the cars, underneath the beds. Look any place your child might hide and then go out and search the entire neighborhood. Search your child's playmates houses and then go back to your own home and if you still don't find your child, immediately call 911. When the police arrive, give them this cassette and the completed form in the Kinder Vision packet. Kids, remember to watch the Kinder Vision video often so you can learn what to do in dangerous situations. This information will help to keep you safe. Mom and Dad, please start teaching your children today. Younger children need to be reinforced more frequently, and all children need to know this information by age four. This information could save your child's life. Thanks for watching, and stay safe.